Man, this some bullshit. What's going on, bro? I mean, what's going on, uh, YouTube, family, friends, and everybody else? Let me tell y'all something very, uh, very straight to the point. Wasn't no employees inside Makita's that day. Them employees was next door at the Family Dollar, right back there. Everything I seen didn't come from where nobody ringing up no cookies. All that shit is fabricated like a motherfucker. Man, I don't know how the fuck they thought they were going to get away with this bullshit with all these goddamn hoes in this goddamn cover of store. If only Big Mouth would have shut up, it would have been harder. It still has been hard. So let me say this again, and I'm just going to make this one point and get the fuck up out of here because I cannot. <laughs> no employees was inside that fucking raggedy ass cookie store when Dolph was placed in there. Maurice Hill, you couldn't clean up all this shit as you was cleaning up, mopping up uh, uh, blood. You mopping up blood that wasn't even there with a dry ass mop, and it's clearly caught on video. So you couldn't mop, <laughs> you couldn't mop none of this shit up. But that, that would explain a lot. Now to Dr. Kia Moore, the one that set up this GoFund to pay these goddamn motherfuckers what they was due. They was used and coerced. Everybody that had on a Makita shirt that day. And one of y'all didn't even belong there. What you know about that shit? Everybody had on uniform that day has got paid off. That's what that GoFundMe was for. So she claimed uh, they lied to her, the Hill family lied to her. You might be lying to us, but one thing we know, uh, they definitely motherfucking lying. And this, this would explain a lot. Because if you go back, every motherfucking body, including them fake-ass employees, with their storage ready. That's why Maurice was so anxious and shit. He wanted to make sure he keep an eye on everything while he walking through the crime scene, which the police, they normally be parked right there every day, all day, uh, conveniently disappeared at the right time and you know why nobody couldn't see nothing you know what i'm saying because they had a van there to distract this is verified information so there will be no motherfucking allegedly i'm gonna make it very short because i know a lot i'm gonna let this sink in right quick and just imagine a whole everything that you know and heard is some bullshit about these makita employees but one thing that's true is that they collected money very smart people but not smart enough to pay these folks to hush, 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 hush. So they got paid and sent to counseling for some shit that they ain't see. Uh, paycheck still coming in. We're going to be closed down for a few months. We're going to pay y'all anyway. It ain't our money, but uh, it's a part of the cover up. Shut the fuck up because we got people on standby in case you don't. And one person ain't supposed to be there. Wasn't supposed to be there that day. And I'm, I'm going to make another video about that. My name ain't true, man. Let this shit soak in. And then <laughs> I'll get back with y'all. Like, share, subscribe. I always fucking support. It's a lot of shit going on behind the scenes right now. And uh, I think it's very good. Matter of fact, I believe with all my heart that uh, we can do it. We, we can get justice for Dolph before November 17th. Because the Fed doing their job. And I'm going to make another video about that. But let that sink in for now. My cash out, uh, dollar sign, true result number two. And uh, everybody can finish this sentence. Make it do what it do. I love y'all. I'm going to holler at y'all later. And uh, let me say this right quick before I go. Remember the other video I told y'all some funny shit? Well, now it's confirmed. Why is the feds? I know y'all doing y'all job and I know y'all watch YouTube. But why y'all telling me? True, man.